all the water. Look at all that water. We're going to drink it. Good morning. Welcome to the vlog. It's just me right now. But this morning we're both sort of recommitting ourselves to our diets and our exercise programs that we really enjoyed last spring and summer and fall, but we kind of lulled out of it in the winter. Um, me because I went back to work and my schedule got screwed up, and Trish because she got butter. off of work and <laughs> her schedule got all messed up, so we kind of yeah, we got out of our healthier habits that we like to do, like drinking 60 Two ounces of water. <laughs> well, that's a lot. I got thirty-two. I don't know. We got thirty. We got thirty-two <laughs> ounces of water right now. We're gonna start off there, um, but yeah, we like to eat pretty healthy yogurt for breakfast and yeah. salads with our we're just gonna keep chicken or fish. Now. We're just gonna be more mindful about what we're putting into. Our yes, body. we busted this out last night. And my Fitbit. That's Trisha's area. It tells her her all of her stuff. <laughs> I don't know. It does a bunch of cool things. It's like it's it's one of those really cool scales that like syncs up to your body and it tells you like all of your, like your body fat content and like how much you've lost throughout the day. Like you got to measure yourself throughout the day and stuff. And, I don't know. It's weird. But it's good. It's cool and it it tracks her sleep and everything. She got like the Fitbit on her wrist and it tracks her sleep patterns and like when she was like stirring throughout the night and tracks REM sleep. So we're both looking forward to getting back on that train because we're both healthy people and we'd like to get back to being healthy people. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? I could have brushed my teeth. I'm getting ready to get on the bus. Oh, me too. Same these. Rose. <laughs> yeah, I gotta go. We gotta go get groceries and then I have to go to another massage appointment and then straight home this time on the bus no cabs <laughs> yeah well Spencer found this gem in like I think it was like the international food aisle wasn't it yeah cuz they have Cause it's, it's imported it's from... like relabeled for Canada he said yeah you can Sorry. see she tried to take up the corner oh. of it right yeah. here they have to relabel it when they bring it to Canada because there's certain things that they have to tell us in Canada that they don't have to tell the people in the States. And there's certain things vice versa. And you can't get cherry coke here. Oh, it's so good. But I guess they started breaking it into the international section, which is cool. <laughs> but we prefer yes. Diet Coke, so we went with the Diet Coke cherry coke. It's fruit. delicious. I mean, like, I'd probably get the full one next time as, like, a treat, but. Yeah, I can definitely tell it's diet. <laughs> the cherry is nice. The cherry flavor is nice. I like it. I like it a lot. So. Mm. Okay. Okay. Nom, nom, nom. No miracles at massage therapy today. Don't count on that. But there's a miracle in this kitchen, and it's meat. And potatoes, and it's gonna be a pie. This is gonna be delicious. Oh, he's a good cook. Okay, so first of all, this is per 100 milliliters. The relabeling says, where is it? Three milligrams of sodium. Spencer pulled off the original packaging. We don't care. We're gonna drink them anyway. But it says per. Where is it? Per 100. Yeah, per 100 milliliters. 0 0.03 grams, not milligrams, grams of salt. So Spencer's looking up to see what that means. So where it says sodium is three milligrams, because this one's in grams, you would expect the translation to be, you have to multiply it by a thousand, so mm -hmm. it should be 0 0.003 grams mm -hmm. that's that's what three milligrams is it's like a really 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 small fraction of a gram and on here it's actually ten times that amount it's it's only to the hundredth decimal place so it's actually 30 grams or 30 milligrams not three milligrams hmm. on the Canadian label but when I scanned it on my fitness pal app, 
that I keep track of all my calories in, it said 100 milligrams of sodium per the whole 300 milliliter can. So, which, which isn't for why was there the relabeling? Why was there a relabeling? That's not for but it's delicious. Time. I know, my Gorilla Pod still hasn't come in the mail. Oh. And tomorrow's like, you know, there's like a minimum and a maximum for when your, your mail comes. Well, tomorrow's supposed to be the, no, today's the 21st, isn't it? It's the first day of spring today, right? I know it's oh. Why is well, everybody going on about the first day of spring? Is it the first day of spring? Do we not know when the first day of spring is? I don't. Okay, well, anyway, tomorrow I believe is the 21st of oh, March. This heavy. I know. <laughs> And I'm, it's supposed to be like the maximum date when they're delivering it, but who knows? It's from China, so I don't know. You heard it here, folks. Uh, good morning, everybody. I just got a little bit of work to do on my computer, and I just called my case manager, too, to see where we're at to get into the St. John assessment. It's like a three-day assessment in St. John with WorkSafe. And then they want to know if they want to put you in a four-week rehab program. So I made that call. I'm going to go wait for her call today. And I think the only thing we have to do is go pick up my stuff that I left at work because they needed the office space for someone. So, yeah, it's going to be a little bit of work and then a knitting morning. Well, I think all you knitters out there know what this means. Ribbit. <laughs> I had to frog my work again. <laughs> Good thing for lifelines. So basically, in this pattern... Uh, the other ones like are under stitch markers so they relatively stay the same but this one changes so <laughs> you have to just repeat this part so guys read your patterns completely and thoroughly so you don't have to frog your work twice now oh! We are watching some Dave Chappelle tonight. You guys should check it out. It's really funny already. I was making some popcorn. And uh, yeah, that's about it for tonight. Literally just started sewing. And you can really see it because they're huge flakes. But I have to go to physio. Wow, yeah. This has escalated quickly. Just don't snow that much until I get home, please. It'd be very nice of you. Of me, Jack. But my camera like evened out. It was like super orange at first. Yeah, I have like 20 minutes to suck down a coffee before I go because <sighs> yay for early appointments. <laughs> I like my hat. It's my favorite. I'll link the pattern down below. The windowsills in our apartment are too tiny for the cat. And he <laughs> just... <laughs> He just wants more. He room. just wants more window sill. Why are the window sills so tiny in this house? I just want to sit in the window sill, Mama. Please, Mama. Please. Don't. Don't, don't do that. Don't. don't do that. No. Take it away from you completely. Don't do that either. <laughs> hey. Get out of it. Don't we'll open a, it. Don't be a weirdo. Be it. Be it. All right, it is Wednesday and uh, I'm just getting ready to film another episode of Fixing Knitting Mistakes, which will be out sometime. I don't know. I need to put a fun video out. I feel like I've been putting out like a lot of tutorial videos and I need to put a, a fun video out. Oh, look how much more illuminated I am. Yee. So yeah, I'm going to get this started and then uh, there might be another adventure coming up. What do you want? You don't like when my door is closed, do you? No. No, Mama, what are you doing in here? And the answer is stuff with the iron. So that's why you can't come in, little kitty. Little kitty cat. All right, well, I told you we were going to have a whole adventure. Adventure is I'm going to cut your hair for the first time. Oh, no. <laughs> I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos, so where's the clippers? And if she gets it wrong, I get to shave it off. But she doesn't want me to. No. 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 I don't want you. I don't want you to shave up your hair so pretty. Should I be doing this? Who knows? No. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I'm sure.
<laughs> Maybe this was a bad idea. <laughs> I might get to shave my head. No, don't shave all of it. Just do what you usually do. I have no hair left. And I still have hair. <laughs> it's gonna be all evened out in a couple of months by a professional. <laughs> I like that hairstyle. It suited me and it, and it was comfortable and it was easy to take care of. Not that this isn't gonna be easy to take care of or anything, but it was nice, and I had it for a long time, and just that one time that I went to a cheap barber. Don't skimp out if you're going somewhere. Just pay whatever price is regular price. Just pay that <laughs> price. When you go cheap, you get cheap stuff. And no. she tried to fix it. It just wasn't happening. So. It was too far gone, so I had to just cut it off, and we're going to restart. So it'll probably take about two months before I cut my hair again. That's okay. But, uh, wait until then, I guess. Either I me know. or him are going near his hair again. <laughs> no, no. Unless it's for, like, a trim on the sides, but... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was just way too far over for me to fix. Yeah. And, uh, and next time I'm going to a professional. Yeah. So we're going to say bye for this vlog and if you liked it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I guess you have to hit this little notification thingy too if you want to get notified that our videos have come out and uh, we'll see you next time. Hit down there. I don't down know. there. <laughs> bye. It's just like our original video. Oh he's so cute. Where is he? Is that a cat? Hello? So it's not a free fall. Oh, he's, he's too it's happy. He's very happy in there. Uh, Alright, well, once you get down...